Hey Aquarius, welcome back to the channel guys. My name is Nali aka Owl Tarot and I'm here to bring you guys your weekend love messages. We're going to see what's coming towards you guys, what is the overall energy messages and outcomes. But before we get started, please don't forget to like, share, subscribe, click that notification bell. It allows me to connect with you energetically and it definitely helps me out with the growth of the channel. As you all know, these readings are timeless general love readings, so they may or may not resonate with you. Please take what does, leave the rest behind. Time is fluid, so whenever you find this reading, you are meant to hear it. There is no gender in tarot, guys. Please reverse the roles as need be. If you're interested in booking a personal reading, guys, the information is in the description box below. Please don't forget to check out my community tab. I do post uh, specials throughout the weekend. All right, guys, we're going to go ahead and get started here. We're going to see what are the overall messages for you, what is coming towards you this week, and what can you expect. Universe, Archangel, Spirit, Angel, Guides, and Guardians, overall energy. You got an apology coming towards you, Aquarius. Someone's getting ready to take that initiative, come in and apologize to you for some past mistakes here. Addiction. An addiction isn't affecting your relationship. So I feel that in the past there could have been some type of addictive behavior here. Your person could have liked going out a lot, partying, maybe even doing drugs or drinking. But there is an energy of this person releasing that addiction, coming back towards you, apologizing. You also got this obsessive energy here, obsession. So this person may be in this energy where they're obsessing, trying to get back towards you, trying to find it difficult to come towards you because you may even have them blocked. But they do want to come in. They do want to apologize to For some of you guys, they may be offering marriage here, okay? I feel that you lost your patience with this person in the recent past. You had given them a lot of opportunities to change and do right by you, but they just never took those opportunities. So somewhere along the line, you decided to walk away from this addictive person. You decided to let go of the situation. You lost a lot of patience with this person. And out of nowhere, past life love here, your soul, your soul remembers this intense connection so i feel that this person is going to come in want to have this conversation with you wanting to apologize to you i feel that they're in this obsessive energy not necessarily obsessing about something you're doing but obsessing that they know that they have to come in here and make things right with you and there's a there's an energy of them wanting to show you how things used to be when everything was right with you and them okay so it's like you you having a, a refresher in that energy when you guys first met, when everything was so copacetic, nice and sweet. This person's trying to come back in in that energy so they can, so you guys can relive those moments if that makes sense. Okay. Universe, Archangel, Spirit, Angel, Guides, and Guardians, please help me give my Aquarius clear and concise messages here. What happened with Aquarius in the recent past? What happened with Aquarius and this person in the recent past? Universe, Archangel, Spirit, Angel, Guides, and Guardians. You got the temperance in the reverse. So there was definitely a loss of balance here, a loss of a patience. You were very patient with this person. You gave them a lot of time to make things right with you, to, to clear up some situations here, to release some toxic behaviors. They may have been having to deal with an empress in the reverse here. Maybe one of their, maybe their ex was giving them problems or their children's mother. Whatever the situation was, you gave this person ample time to get all of that resolved. Because this person chose not to resolve that situation and because they chose to stay in this toxic energy, this addictive energy, you decided to walk away from this situation. You got tired of waiting for this person to make things right. You got tired for this waiting on this person to either resolve some type of legal situation or resolve some type of divorce and or child support court and you decided to move away ace of pentacles energy in the reverse is that this person when they first came in in the beginning they were offering you everything and then some and out of nowhere you felt like they were keeping secrets with the moon here okay you felt like they weren't being truthful that they weren't telling you everything that was going on and this started causing a lot of um addictive behavior a lot of obstacles a lot of toxicity between you and this person this person could have definitely been emotionally manipulating okay they stopped moving towards the connection they started creating their own blockages when there was no blockages okay so somewhere along the line you lost patience with this person you packed your things up and you left universe archangel spirit angel guides and guardians you walked away from this commitment hierophant in the reverse as a matter of fact you felt like this person wasn't even committed to you anymore so you just decided to walk away universe archangel spirit angel guides and guardians what is the current energy between libra i'm sorry you're dealing with the libra possibly because i literally said libra 
um, or current energy with Aquarius and this person. Expect communication from this person this weekend, Aquarius. There's some communication coming in, two of wands energy. I feel that whatever this person was dealing with in the recent past, whatever was causing him or her blockages and not allowing them to move towards you and resolve this situation, all of that has been removed. This person will be reaching out to you this weekend, wanting to have a conversation with you, wanting to resolve things. They're hoping and praying that with the seven of wands in the reverse, you're not guarded and you allow them to come in to at least be able to apologize for all the past mistakes that they made, for all the heartaches that they caused you, or for any any type of interference that was allowed into the connection. Universe, Archangel, Spirit, Angel, Guides, and Guardians, what is this person's overall intentions here with my Aquarius? This person intends to show you that they want to put the work in the connection. They want to show you how things used to be, as I told you at the beginning of the reading, Nine of Pentacles energy here. When you first met, this person was single, abundant, healthy, happy. They want to show you that they can get back to that with you. Two of Cups energy, they're hoping and praying that there's an opportunity for a reunion or reconciliation, that you would accept their offer, that you would forgive and forget whatever it is that they did to you in the past. I feel that this person's coming in with the intentions of doing things right with you, doing right by you, because at the end of the day, with the lovers here, this person views you as their soulmate. They know that they caused you a lot of pain. They know that they left you in this Nine of Swords energy where you might have felt desolate, desperate, angry, depressed. But this person's coming in because now they're wanting to prove to you that they've moved past all those blockages, that they've resolved all those situations. This time around, this person is not coming in this Hierophant in the reverse. They're coming in with true true commitment true truth and clarity and forward movement universe archangel spirit angel guides and guardians what is the outcome in this situation for my aquarius please king of swords energy aquarius you may be dealing with an air sign but this person here is coming in because they're wanting to balance things out with you two of pentacles king of swords they're very decisive as to what they want in this connection moving forward they're wanting to talk to you. They're wanting to manifest you back in your life or in their life. I'm sorry. The fact that this person used to be confused in the past and did not know what decision they needed to make today. They know what they want. They want you back in their life. They want their happy home. They want their queen of cups, their loving situation, their loving marriage, their loving relationship. They want their happily ever after. They want this back. So I feel that this person is coming and fighting for this. They're coming and wanting to get, gain your respect again, gain your trust again. Nine of Cups energy. For some of you guys, this is a wish fulfillment. This is what you always wanted this person to do in the past, okay? This is what you were hoping for and praying for. And for you guys, Three of Cups energy here, Nine of Cups and Ace of Cups. Come on, man. This person's coming in, bringing you the moon, the stars, whatever it is that you want, this person is bringing towards you because finally, there's truth, there's clarity, there's a new beginning, there's a new opportunity here, there's a reunion, reconciliation, there's been a judgment in a past situation, so if they were dealing with divorce or child support or whatever it is, that's already come to an end. This person is victorious and they're coming back towards you, bringing this connection back in from out of the cold, bringing it in from isolation and wanting to have an equal give and take. They're coming in here offering you a new beginning in love, a reunion, a reconciliation, and the promise of giving you happily ever after, okay? All right, guys, I hope and pray that, that this reading gave you the clarity that you needed. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Click that notification bell. And if you want to book a personal reading, the info is in the description box below. I'll talk to you guys soon. Take care. Bye.